Yeah, it's rewind time. Yeah, if I control rewind, I would want Fortnite and Marquez Brownlee. Is this what you wanted? You know who I would have asked for? The fuck you say to me, you little shit! How are you not in fucking school? Oh, fuck you, faggot. You kiss your mother with that mouth? <laughs> you shut up when I'm talking to you! You shut your mouth! <laughs> oh, that's hot. That's hot. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. <laughs> Uh, YouTube, 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 what are you doing? Oh, uh, that's- No! No! What are you doing? YouTube Rewind just did not do what it's supposed to. Did not at all. <laughs> oh, that's hot. That's hot. What is the world come to? Like, YouTube, come on. It's just advertising for, for brands, basically. It's YouTube advertising saying, look, this is what we have on this channel, on this platform. We want to do ads for you, basically. And there was nothing of what we thought there would be. You know, Logan Paul versus KSI, you know, PewDiePie, so many things that they missed out that so many youtubers that weren't in it and the ones that were aren't too happy and there's so many videos that i've seen good and bad about it casey nice that it made a video in defense of youtube rewind 2018 because he knows a lot of the people involved and he gave that point of view that you know these people worked hard on this a lot of money was spent yeah what if it gets to monetize imagine that Spent all these billions, millions, whatever it is. Got all these famous people, these YouTubers. Well, half of them aren't even YouTubers, you know. There's talk show hosts that are in it. You know, Will Smith, yeah, maybe. He was big on YouTube this year. Yeah, he had that, that uh, jump he did for his 50th birthday. So, yeah, he, he's allowed on there. But, like, the beginning bit just makes me laugh. Like, Fortnite, okay. Yeah, Ninja, you're big on Twitch. You upload your videos, all the best bits of your Twitch live streams as videos on YouTube, but really, are you on YouTube? The fuck you say to me, you little shit? How are you not in fucking school? Um, yeah, just the smaller creators are upset. People like me, well, yeah, they should have put me in there. I should have been in there, because I've done a lot this year. I'm working my ass off here. But no, just jumping out of a Fortnite bus. And yeah, there was a Logan Paul reference, because they were in a forest. Whether it was the suicide forest, we don't know. But there was a few references in there. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you serious? 51,000 upvotes? This is the top vote of all time. Jesus Christ. My favorite part was when they did the Fortnite dances in the suicide forest, but instead of corpses, it's dead channels. <laughs> Brilliant. Beauty Pie's chair did get in there. Um, to an animator who, who's... Uh, it was in the video. Uh, I think it's Jade in animations or something. PewDiePie mentions her in his video. And she animated in his chair into her part of the YouTube Rewind. But the Casey bit, going back to Casey, was just K-pop. Just him and some other YouTubers chatting K-pop. K-pop! K-pop! And it just gets really annoying. And then you got Trevor Noah trying to do a floss. Too many Fortnite things going on in this video. Fortnite is a game. Whether YouTube ever deal with Epic Games, I don't know. You never know, that's probably why they've got that feel to the video. But Will Smith did genuinely say Marcus Brownlee and Fortnite. He couldn't pronounce the name right. He said Mark Ass. Marky, Mark S. Mark. It's got a Q in there anyway. Mark, not Marcus, but not Mark up. Fortnite 
and Marquez Brownlee. Us. Marquez. Will Smith. That will forever be a meme when you look through the uh, the telescope or the binoculars at the end and he's just like, ah, oh, that's hot. I've seen one meme where like, he looks through, right? Ah, oh, that's hot. That's hot. Ah! And it's just the sun he's looking at. Oh, that's hot. Well, yeah. Of course the sun's hot. What else is it going to be? This, this is so memeable. PewDiePie did a great job of memeing this. Like, everything involved in it is just wrong. I mean, they've been making YouTube Rewind since 2011 or 2012. And back then it was on a smaller scale, you know. They weren't trying to cram everyone in. But in, in trying to cram everyone into this video, they've upset a lot of people with over 10 million dislikes. I think I mentioned it in my podcast, it was 7 million. Now it's gone up to 10 million, million dislikes. So yeah, he didn't go, I mean, even last year didn't go down too well. But they were popular in the past, just not this year. I've talked about it on the podcast already. You know, it's trying to showcase the best of YouTube and to cater for advertisers and people like that. So it's, there's a big gap between what people on YouTube are actually watching and liking and not liking and what YouTube want to promote to advertisers to make money ultimately. But of course, apparently the, uh, the YouTubers didn't get paid to be there. Of course, it's good for them to get to get into YouTube Rewind. Casey was honoured, he said. A lot of them were. And Michael Dapper was in there briefly. But there's been big events that have been missed out. Yeah, but to keep it squeaky clean. They don't want controversy, do they? Because you've got Logan Paul. He's controversial in the past. He has been. Uh, KSI as well. Recently. Um, but think of what Logan Paul's podcast has done recently, Impulsive, so he's come a long way, so that should should have been mentioned somewhere in there. Yeah, I think they made it back in November, but they've got to, you know, they've got to do a better job next year. But is it going to change that much? I don't know, because they've had the same company, or well, YouTubers have the same company making the videos since maybe 2013. 2013 was probably the last good one that people were actually happy with. I mean, I saw an H3 video, and Ethan mentioned it as well. Top comment with 200,000 likes. It says, I'm impressed. They managed to make it worse every year. You know what I think the people want? For YouTube Rewind to stop. All right, let's erase 2018 Rewind from our mind. Let's go back to 2013, one of the most beloved and most liked YouTube Rewinds of all time. Saying that that was the best one. I mean, PewDiePie's been in previous ones, but this year he's done so much with the, the, the record of sub subscribers, you know, beating T-Series, destroying T-Series, or whatever you want to call it. True Geordie as well, my, uh, my guy. Everyone's guy when it comes to MMA and boxing. And he's got a great podcast. So yeah, well, you know, me, of course, should be in there from the outset. Should be the first name on that list. YouTube, I'm writing a letter. An angry, what? What is this? 1995? No, I'm writing an email. But yeah, a lot of uh, people are getting disheartened about this, but don't, you know, it's just, there's a dip, like I said, there's a gap between what we want and what YouTube are catering for to their advertisers, like, they're catering towards them as opposed to what the people want. <laughs> Give the people what they want. But yeah, that is it on YouTube Rewind. We'll see what happens. Got more videos to come guys more reaction to what's going on in the world of media but yeah youtube that is so i started watching marcus brownie after seeing the, the the comments on rewind and his comments on it i saw his video his reaction to it um but i, I was already subscribed to him and didn't realize how i watched a few of his videos when i needed tech support let's just say but here we are so it does help with fame, but Casey Neistat shouting K-pop, is that what you want? <laughs> that's not what he want. I don't think that's what he wanted to say. But they did say a lot of what was trying to be captured wasn't. That the act, the act, I mean, the YouTubers involved, they all said that. Like there were a lot of act, hours put in, and it wasn't all going to show. It didn't all show in the video. But yeah, I'm still here making movies. 
Hopefully I'm inspiring you guys. But yeah, just a little reaction to YouTube Rewind. Just remember guys, subscribe to PewDiePie. I've well, he's won by now. Surely. But do not let T-Series win. If it's banner, it's banner. Or it's just BS, I don't know. Anyway guys, I want to thank you for joining me once again. I'm going to enjoy the rest of my Saturday. Football, a lot of football on today. It's cold out there guys. It's Apparently we've got a lot of ice coming in. Frost. Maybe snow. It's cold. So wrap up warm and take it easy fam. Remember, just be nice. It's Christmas. Fight T-Series. YouTube really doesn't care about our troops. Why I wasn't in YouTube Rewind this year. Dane, now you step too far, YouTube. Dane wasn't in YouTube Rewind? Disgusting. Dane is a hero. Now, just to be clear, I don't know if Dane is a Nazi. I haven't done facts check. I haven't done fact check. I'll sit and watch your car burn